the president uh, focusing very much on the COVID pandemic per se in the first half of that address. He then moved on to the uh, the state of the French economy. And, you know, let's not forget we're entering an election cycle here in France. We're about five, six months away from, from, from ele- less than six months away from elections here. Uh, very keen to highlight how well, in fact, France has fared, economically speaking, these last let's say this last this last year and uh, you know credit to the president for that yes uh, it sounded very presidential because he talked about the pandemic yes he talked about the economy but he talked also about a number of issues he talked about police he talked about justice he talked about the environment he talked about europe he talked about uh, rebuilding an industry uh, about french sovereignty to me it sounded very presidential you know it was nearly half an hour long but yes on the economy he just had to mention uh, a few numbers growth over six percent it's unseen in years unemployment near nearing a 15 year record low while uh, the uh, budget deficit is under 5% and so clearly uh, the president uh, knows that the figures uh, speak for him uh, because obviously there was a lot of concern uh, about uh, where this was going france was spending a lot of money uh, whether this would provide a boost to the economy and it is uh, providing a boost to the uh, economy he also said Uh, and this is probably going to please the conservative uh, part of his electorate, that uh, the unemployment benefits, uh, the conditions would be much more severe to have them. You would need to work at least six months in the past two years to get them. Until now, it was four months. So this is probably not a wink toward uh, the right-wing electorate that he's been cultivating uh, on the economy, but also on the law and order uh, issue. And he said on on this issue that there would be a a new budgetary law voted uh, very soon uh, to uh, provide more means for the police, for the justice system. I should just add one thing. Uh, There was a lot of talk in recent months that he would uh, try to get back to one of the failed reforms of his uh, mandate, the pension system reform. And uh, he said that the conditions are not ripe to launch such uh, a reform. However, he said there should be a democratic debate, that's the way he framed it, about the possibility to work longer. And uh, so he hinted that, you know, that may be something uh, that could be ripe for a second mandate. Obviously, he didn't say whether he will run again. But uh, if I read the leaves uh, correctly, uh, he probably is thinking about this very, very hard. Okay, well, thank you very much indeed for your analysis. Our French politics editor, Mark Perelman, thank you very much indeed.